Hey guys, just a quick tip um, on something that I've been doing over the last month. I wanted to share now that I've kind of tested it out and it seems to be working just fine. Um, we all have these glues. We all love these glues. We all know the number one problem with the glossy accents is as soon as you open it, it clogs up every single time. It doesn't matter if you do the little slam it to the bottom. It doesn't matter. You can't leave pins or anything in them because they tend to, to oxidize. I think that's what it's called. And scotches can be the same way. If you're not careful with it, it'll plug up. The other thing that I don't like about these two glues in the, the sense of them is the size of their nozzles. This is a brand new one, so I haven't cracked it yet. But um, even though they look really tiny, they don't always, well, this one clogs. It has a tiny, tiny nozzle. This one doesn't clog so much, but the nozzle, even on these red ones, which is the thinnest hole that you can get, is still a pretty good size hole. So I had bought several of these irresistibles. Now I'm not claiming that this is my original idea. I'm just saying this was my light bulb moment and I'm sure that other people have come up with it because I found a product that did it. So anyways, that out of the way. I had um, bought the shimmer one of the irresistibles, which I don't recommend. It's terrible. It's glossy accents with just a little bit of shimmer in it. It's don't buy it. Uh, the white one, awesome. The several of the I have several of these colors. If you guys are interested in a mini review on them, um, and I can pretty much point you in the direction of what not to buy, because <laughs> I bought them. Anyways, um, the nice thing about these are they have a needle tip which looks like this and the lid comes with basically a stopper that goes inside the needle tip and if you take these apart the cool thing about them is they're just um, a flattened off needle syringe needle um gosh i had a ton of these with my dog <laughs> but his of course were sharp so no i didn't torture him but anyways, um, what I like about these is that with the stopper, these are basically colored glossy accents. They work just like it. You can even glue with them. I've even glued with them. I used up the shimmer one as glue. Um, but the, the plug goes all the way up into the cap, which means it goes all the way to the bottom of the needle. So then you just put it back in, screw on your lid, and it never clogs, ever. I've had these for these for almost two months now. They don't clog. Works wonderful. So my brilliant idea was I had the shimmer one, which again was basically glossy accents with a little bit of shimmer. And I dumped a bottle of glossy accents into it. And I've been using it for oh, over a month now. I haven't had a single clog at all ever in it. It has been awesome. It flows wonderfully and it just works really, really good. I'd say the only downside to them is you have to actually be able to see to get them back in the hole. It's like threading a needle. <laughs> get it? Anyways, but um, let me see. I don't think I don't think you'll be able to see. We'll try it. If you're trying to glue on sequins or rhinestones or anything like that, you want just a little itty bitty dot of glue. And the cool thing about these my bottle is almost empty, is that it just take it makes the microscopically sized, can you see <laughs> right there? Oh, as I stuck the needle in it, I'm looking at the screen and not at the camera. But I mean, you can make all, imagine this as those water droplets on your page. And I know it's really bad lighting, but trust me, they're there. You can kind of see the reflection e right there. But anyways, it's perfect for putting on your sequins and stuff when you just need that little bit of glossy accents. It has not oxidized. There's no silvering of the, the glossy accents, which if you've stuck a stick pin in them, you know that it has turned color. It, it turned color. Um, and it works like a charm. But nobody wants to buy this to get this bottle. So I went searching on Amazon, and I ran across these fine line applicators and they look like this and there'll be a link down below to them i got the 20 gauge and i kind of guessed they have an 18 gauge that's larger so if you wanted a little bit larger hole than what these have um, these have an, a 20 gauge uh, they're the same size as um 
these two are the same size. There is an 18 gauge, so if you wanted a little bit bigger hole, you could easily get the 18 gauge. I'll also leave the link down below to the 18. Um, they were $9, about $9 for two of them in a pack. What I did with the other one, since I already had this one for glossy accents, I took the Scott's Quick Dry and I put it in the other one. So I could see if it would flow, you know, same basic principle, has the, the plug and the needle. Um, the only difference is that this one doesn't come out quite as far, which really doesn't matter at all. <laughs> Hold on, I gotta plug it in. Sign that I need new glasses. Okay, anyway, so I filled it up. I didn't fill it completely full because I thought, well, I'm not gonna waste it if it doesn't work. But this, can you see? Look at, you can do even smaller. You can do lines. And I'm, I'm trying to do this under the camera, but I am not pushing that hard. Uh, two fingers, you just, isn't that cool? Okay, so that is my find. Again, I'm not saying I originally come up with this idea because they make it for glue. So obviously somebody came up with this before me. But I did want to share that I've used it now with um, the quick dry adhesive in one and I've also this is the same gauge needle so it works just the same with the glossy accents so if you're interested in these or you just want to see what the product looks like that you're going to be searching for because you can buy it anywhere well I don't know if you can buy it anywhere I found them on Amazon both links for the 20 gauge and the 18 will be down below this is the 20 gauge that I showed today I recommend checking them out great I mean they're not cheap but you can reuse them you just keep filling the bottle yay so no more clogged glossy accents and fine tip scotch dry. Yay! <laughs> Thanks for watching, you guys. Uh, leave me a comment. Likes are always welcome. And you have a wonderful day. I'll see you in the next video. Later.